good morning so I'm just about to make a quick sandwich um so hope you enjoy it so i'm just getting my pan on i'm just gonna make it nice and hot ingredients are very very simple nothing complicated we've got red onions we've got garlic got red peppers and um, bell peppers red and green um, we've got black pepper we've got some salt for seasoning we've got our ham ham and that's literally all i'm doing very simple not complicated just fancy something nice right so our pan is hot now i'm just going to use a bit of stir fry oil and you can get this from asda or in any shop really that sells oriental spices and oils and stuff like that you can get it from there i'm just going to use a little bit i don't need a lot um to start off my food I'm going to start off by browning my onions. Just want to make sure that it is definitely hot yet. Yeah, it's hot enough so I can put the rest in. The way this works is very, very simple. You just literally just brown in everything off. Um, I'm going to put some butter in our mixture. I'm going to put a little bit of olive butter in there. This is bring everything together. We don't want to overcook our onions, so we're just going to put in our ham. Now I'm going to just cut the ham a little bit whilst it's in the pot because I don't want them to be too big. I just want them to be nice and strict. I should have done this before, but I didn't. You can use chicken, you can use um, prawns for this recipe. You don't have to necessarily use ham, but I'm using ham because that's what I wanted. So you can use whatever you want. I should have used a bigger wok because the smaller one, the whole, this one is taking a bit longer. But that's absolutely fine. Right, now, at this point, I'm just going to put in my peppers and then I'll season and let it take its time to cook. sizzle in the pan. Right, I'm just going to put another pan on here. This is where I'm going to do my toast my buns. So when that's ready, I can start working on my buns. I'm sorry to interrupt you, but Daddy said you should ask. Yes. So I just tasted my my ham, and I think we need a bit of a kick. So 
I have some chitwa that I made earlier. I'm just going to put that into the air directly. Because at the moment, the heat that I'm looking for is not in there. And I want it to be nice and hot, spicy. Toasting, you can see it's already started to brown. I'm just gonna maximize that a little bit so you can see. There we go. Our bun's looking a little bit more brown. Beautiful. cheeses are beginning to melt and the next part um, is very very simple we want our cheese to melt so what we're gonna do is we don't need the heat coming at the moment we're just gonna turn off and all I'm doing is I'm gonna put in one layer of cheese there the pan is really really hot And because there's already heat coming from there, it's just gonna melt the cheese beautifully. I don't need to do anything else with that. Okay, and I'm just gonna grab a screen because I don't wanna lose any of my... Well, bring it a bit closer to me so I can see what I'm doing. She's melting beautifully. There's so much juices in here, we don't need any more sauce. <laughs> Show you the finished products in a bit. There we go. Cheese is melting beautifully, and everything is just looking absolutely beautiful. Thanks for watching, and enjoy your day.